Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas, I'm your host, and I'm here with... TNT Dynamite, the explosive one. Jonas, you're the man on us. I am, I'm holding it. We're playing Madden 20, the oiled up daddies. Ooh. From, Daddy. Hugh, from Houston town. <laughs> the Houston daddies. Mm. Yep. I love, I love a good Houston dad story, Jonas. <laughs> Back when I was seven, my dad took me to Houston. Not really. I've never been to Houston. You've been to Houston before. I've, I've been to Sugarland, which is not quite Houston. Really? Hey, yeah, I had to go there for a job interview that I didn't get. Mm. Yeah, it was Everybody great. tells me Houston's like great. Uh, the weather is terrible. It is like the heat of Austin and the humidity of Florida. Really? Yeah, it's like, because it's right on the Gulf. I like that, though. So it's like 100 degrees and humid all the time. That No, you don't. <laughs> I know you okay, don't like I'm that. I'm sorry. I guess I don't like it, then. <laughs> Dude, who? No. I didn't. Look, I look. Florida was effing nuts sometimes, but I did love Florida. <laughs> When I was in air conditioning, right, and but it, but it was only like eighties and nineties. Imagine being a hundred. Eighties and night, no, fam, fam. I stayed off the coast of Cape Canaveral. Okay. Eighties and nineties was like winter temperatures. Oh, was it? It got the up to it was a hundred and twenty-six degrees on a regular in the summer. Hundred twenty-six. It gets you live in a nuts. goddamn swamp. <laughs> You lived in a swamp. <laughs> I was halfway down Florida. Dead ass in 15. In the, in the, on a daily. It's crazy. Uh, I to send my mom. Uh, I would always send my mom. Because uh, she lives in Cleveland. Right, right, right. I'll send her just like the weather. The weather thing off of my phone. Take yeah, a yeah, screenshot. Yeah. And I'll be like, oh. <laughs> how's weather in Cleveland? It's say like 70 degrees. With like a 60% chance of rain. Just to make her jealous. Yeah. It's a move. <laughs> I'm trying to get her to move her ass down here. Yeah, that'd be cool. I would not mind having my mom a little closer. That'd be sweet. I don't know I like if I would mom. see her anymore, but it'd yeah. be nice to have her closer. Yeah, yeah. I feel you. My mom lives. Yeah, my mom lives quite a ways away from here. Is, well. is your mom coming down again? Uh, not this year. She didn't come last year. Uh, I don't know. She came first year. Yeah, she came, it came like five or six years in a row. Okay. Um, including back to when I was married and stuff, but uh, no, she didn't come last year, and now like, uh, no, she's not. She she's like not. Me. She doesn't love you. She doesn't love you anymore. Yeah, she doesn't love me anymore. All right, cool. No, oh. uh, no, like her, like her situation has changed now. She's on like a fixed income, so it's not, not as like easy for her to, oh. to travel and stuff because she has other expenses now that she like. No, oh, I got you. I got you. Know? you. So it's like before she was working, and now she's on fixed income, so it's not as easy. Oh, that kind of sucks. Yeah. Well, Jonas, hopefully once this YouTube channel gets big enough, we can buy our mom's houses. In fact, you know what? Yeah. Should be our channel goal. To buy our mom's a house? You yeah. just pay off their mortgage that they already have? No. I want to buy my mom a house, Jonas. I think you should buy your mom a respectable house for her to spend her and my mom her last days in. Together? Yeah, no, make them, make not together. Roommates. Make them roommates? <laughs> <laughs> All right, Mom and Mom, I bought you a house. We bought you a house. But guess what? <laughs> you got to live together. And here's the reality. Cam, <laughs> thinking that, dude. They can call it like Mom House. Yeah, we'll do like a, uh, we'll do little shorts on the channel. It's like, like we'll make our own videos. We'll just go hang out and record everything going on. <laughs> We're just like messing up the kitchen. <laughs> yeah, He'll right. be playing like that crazy. <laughs> like little boy investigation music or something. Yeah. Your mom comes in. I know you're going to clean that up. No, Mom, you got it right. <laughs> <laughs> you ever see It's Always Sunny where they put Charlie and Max Mom in the house together and they recorded them? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was a good one. But uh, I can just picture your mom doing a talking head. <laughs> just like sitting in a room. He thinks I'm going to clean that kitchen up. He has another thing coming. <laughs> <laughs> this shows you making eggs. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't know, man. You know what I thought? <laughs> I hate reality TV I know, so bad. Yeah, me too, dude. Me too. God dang it. It's, it's all the same. It's the real thing you've ever watched. Right? Like, I, you know what I want to do? I want to make reality TV and go back to making it real. 
Like, like don't have any like literally like well, the first reality television show was The Real World. And that first season was real. It was real. Yeah. Yeah. Even even when they got into I, I the first one that I actually watched was the one with uh, Puck yeah, and that Pedro. Was real too. Yeah. It was real until about the turn of the century. Like, yes. in the 90s, like because even, like, ro- uh, Road Rules, when that first came out, mm-hmm. that was real, too. But then, then they started getting the ideas of, like, oh, well, we can have, like, semi-real, we put can, it in scenario. Yeah, we spice it up. Right, right. And right. that's what Road Rules was. It was like, let's spice it up. Yeah, let's do these challenges, and it's real. Yeah, because Real World was a lot of just, really, it was just, like, a lot of chilling in the house, sitting there, maybe they go out or something. Right, right, yeah. It was just them living life. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And it, yeah, it was interesting. Man. I always wanted to go on that show. The real world. Yeah, yeah, I did too. When I was when I was like, cause I was a kid, I was a kid, younger when it came out. I was like, man, that'd be cool. No, it wouldn't have been. No, it would have sucked. There's dude. an Austin season. We should go. We should watch that season just to see where they go in Austin and what happened in it. Because huh. it, it's like it's there probably is fi- an Austin season. It was probably, I may have probably 15 it. years old by now. But. I may have actually watched that one. I was a pretty avid watcher of that show. I used to watch that a lot, too. Well, I used to watch MTV a lot back then because it was like, it, it still had music, and it was music and reality TV, and they were the only two cha- it was the only channel that had it. Yeah, reality TV was new. Mm-hmm. So, and they were like, yeah, they had music and reality TV. And they're like, oh, this is kind of cool. And now what it's turned into is like. Yep, as soon as the boomers got a hold of it, Jones. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, because then so, okay. Survivor and Big Brother. Oh, yeah. You know what I was thinking about today, though, TNT? How much do you think someone would want to be paid to upload all of our videos for us and put in, like, scheduling and stuff? Like, just that part. How much would How they much want? How much do you think that, like, if we were like, hey, we'll, we'll upload them to the SharePoint, you go to the SharePoint, you pull them down and upload them and schedule them out for us. How much do you think someone wants for that? I don't, how, it's not very hard to job. How, how long would it take to do it? If it takes 10 minutes to video, we're talking about... Well, but also, they may not be on super fast internet, so it might take all day to upload the video. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And say they have the same internet we do. You know, that's what I'm saying. So if it takes them 10 minutes to upload... Oh, yeah, you're right, because we got the Google stuff. We got the super fast internet, yeah. That's true. We have, like, 5 megabit upload. All so, right, so at the very most, it takes them an hour to, to, do, do, all, to do all three. All, all four for a day? All four. So you have times five. So I'd say five hours a week. But the work is easy. Do you think they, do you think we pay fifty bucks a week? They do it. That's five ten dollars a day, essentially. Yeah, because it takes them an hour. Who do you know? Do you know someone? No, I'm just curious. Like, oh, are you looking to put an well, ad no, in like, the? Because I was like, okay, I was thinking, like, man, say we say we have like fifty bucks, hundred bucks. We yeah, could just, we could just hire someone to put the videos up for us. <laughs> Honestly, I mean, do you know anybody now who who's got nothing going on? Inside oh, made it hook up some people that we know to be on board, whether they're like a creative director or they do. I would get some people involved, yeah. Get we could get uh Mel to do music. Oh, oh yeah, Mel Gibson, yeah, <laughs> we can get him to do music, yeah. But yeah, man, I like I don't know, or like to make the thumbnails and upload all the videos and all that stuff, like not even like promote, just literally take the time to mm, we, even if we did it where they encoded them to. We do know an artist. I wonder like what they would like, because like if I didn't have to do that part, that'd be awesome. <laughs> right? <laughs> like, who are you telling, man? It's not even like it's that hard. It just—it's enough. Yeah. It's enough to make it feel like a, a task that has to be completed. I mean, well, it feels like a task because it is a task. Yeah, I'm not sitting there with like a big smile, like heck yeah, copy paste. All right, think of a yeah, clever like, oh, day. Make a bunch of thumbnails today. Oh, I can't wait to move this number six and then delete it and then move to number seven and change the color, and delete it and then move to number eight and then change the color and delete it. And... But no, you know what? Last thing I'm going to do is complain because with the help of the listeners, Jonas, I'm going to buy our mama's houses. But I think we should have someone do the videos before we buy them. <laughs> what? It'd be less. You're talking like hundreds of thousands of dollars or like maybe $30,000 a year. Jonas, you are dipping into how. Because we're into the business. That's the mama house fund. The mama house fund? <laughs> <laughs> we got us in our empire, and then we buy Mama House. How do you? How do you think? How do you figure we're streamlining? You think a little house the first time you got a check? 
It's yeah, probably. You probably. Got it, dude. Look, I understand, but you're talking about just hiring somebody to do work that we can't do. You know, I was talking to that bartender the other day <clears throat> when we were at the bar. Oh, oh, uh, remember oh, I was oh. in the back last when you night? Guys, yeah. Oh, okay. I thought, well, we were at oh, a couple bars. Right? Yeah, that's very true. <laughs> Thank you for making us look cooler than we are, Jonas, on the video. Oh, yeah. We're but I was talking to that bartender. And he was like, uh, yeah, so when we first bought the place, it was just a warehouse. And he was like, I think we got a deal when we had our uh, when we had our contractors in because we were right alongside them. Like he was like, or he's like, on the top, I put this myself. I designed all of this stuff. They were very active in the business and they saved money. So why would we put money into having somebody do a job that we're more than capable of doing when we could just pocket that or put it in the mama house fund? Because it, the reason we would do that is because it frees us up to make more videos. Oh, but see, now you're up at the dollar price. I think we could find some that for us. I feel like we could too, but... It wouldn't be very expensive. <laughs> No, we don't. Once a week, and we try to give up twenty five hundred dollars a month each. No, you wouldn't do it. No, I can put my half up. You <laughs> <laughs> Why would I put something? That, 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 there's, there's not even a mama house fund. Single sis I'm just, I'm just, I'm in the house kidding. mama fun at all. No. Yeah, no, I wouldn't either. But yeah, yeah, you, no, you I were not thinking pay, about it. I wouldn't pay somebody. Dude, it's not that hard. It's Mo not. Millennials are everything's a subscription with you, millennials. I say, yeah, I know. <laughs> everything's a subscription. Oof. I kind of feel like everything's a subscription now, anyway. Yeah, it is. I feel like I've gone over this. I feel like my car's a subscription because I constantly have to put gas in it. Yeah, and buy tires. Yeah. My uh, my TV remote, it's a subscription because I subscribe to Duracell and then, you know, you, you, then I have you to buy pay more. a once a year fee if that. Yeah, well, you know what? That's a, that's too much as and far you, as I'm concerned. What you buy is, is a surplus of what you need. One pack will last you two or three years if you don't use the batteries on something else. I don't it's care. Like, it's like a tri-annual subscription. <laughs> it's 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 <laughs> not the price. It's the principle. Electricity is a subscription. You sub Ohio <laughs> old school. You subscribe to uh, uh, Texas heat. And heat is a subscription. Texas Texas heat and heat is a subscription. <laughs> the business. Yeah. Sounds great. Um, food is a subscription. Cause yeah. I always have to buy more food. There's, I can't just buy food and own it. I mean, you do. You own it, but then you eat it. Yeah, and then I have to poop it out because digestion is a subscription. You are out of control. I'm right? not, Joe. I'm just saying. You're just <laughs> I'm convinced that everything is a subscription model. There's microtransactions everywhere. Where did we start this episode at? Uh, reality TV, mom house. I don't know. <laughs> Either way, it's over. So that is all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to Woo! If you've already done that, please make sure to share the video with a friend. Do it. Because we don't have any. That's a lie. We have some, but we need more. For Jonas. TNT Dynamite. We'll catch you on the next one. We. Oh. Oh.